breaking news right off the top of a deadly alligator attack on the Treasure Coast. Good afternoon and thank you for joining us for WPBF 25 News at 4. I'm Tiffany Kenny and I'm Jay Jarvis in for Shane Wright. It's a story you saw first on WPBF.com and the WPBF 25 News app. That gator was pulled from a Fort Pierce pond after that attack on an 85 year old woman. The Florida Fish and Wildlife Conservation Commission is investigating how this happened. Our Terry Parker joining us now live from the Spanish Lakes Fairways community with what we know right now. Terry. Tiffany, a truly horrifying afternoon here in Spanish Lakes. We know that the gator has been pulled out of the water now by trappers, a gator that is so huge. It was lurking on the bottom of the lake. The sheriff telling us it was almost 11 feet long and witnesses telling us that it snatched that elderly woman right off the bank. Let's take a look at the video from earlier. You'll see this is the gator after the trappers pulled it out of the lake. The sheriff's helicopter was in the air shortly after the 911 call around noon, saying a resident here at Spanish Lakes Fairways had been attacked by an alligator. Neighbors tell us she had been walking a dog when the gator lunged out of the water and grabbed her. FWC has not told us exactly what happened after that, except to say the victim died of her injuries. Here is that trapper explaining how they caught the gator. Snagged him on the bottom. Um, he never surfaced. He stayed down the whole time. We were able to get a second hook in him and then get a hard line in him so we could get him up. But it was definitely a fight. How much do you think he weighed? <laughs> six, seven? Oh, easy. Easy six, seven hundred pounds. Yeah. And neighbors here are telling me that they knew this gator was living in the lake. He often uh, sunned on the banks here, but I guess no one uh, expected that he would actually grab a person and take them out into the lake and uh, kill them. I did talk to the sheriff who says that FWC is handling this investigation and doesn't really want them to say too much about what has happened right now. And so we're waiting to get more details from FWC right now. And coming up in, at five o'clock, hear more from neighbors who witnessed what happened as well as see all new video of that gator being pulled out of the lake and putting up that great big fight. Live in Fort Pierce, I'm Terry Parker, WPBF 25 News.